down, slow me down, slow me down. Hey guys, it's me, it's just Tiffany B, and I'm back with another video. And you guys, we're talking about guess what we're talking about? <laughs> um, we're talking about the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit featuring Nicole Guerrero. So I am in love with Nicole Guerrero. And I'm so happy that they partnered together to do this highlighter kit because it looks so gorgeous, you guys. It is very beautiful. And when you open it up, it does come with six shades. This palette does cost $40 and you can find it at Sephora. So let's go ahead and jump right on into how I applied it to my cheekbones because I am wearing it today. So when I do apply this highlighter, I decided to go in with Glow Getter and I'm using my Real Techniques 300 Bold Metal Collection Brush. So I do notice as I'm picking up the highlighter that a lot of kick up comes along with this highlighter because as I'm picking up the highlighter, a lot is just dusting all over the palette. So let's just see how it applies to my cheeks. So as soon as I see it touch my cheeks, it's just like, whoa, hold up. Wait a second. <laughs> um, it does have a lot of pigmentation. I was a little nervous when I saw the glitters in there, but it's very, I don't see it on my cheek as much. You know what I mean? Like I see the highlighter just popping with no glitter in there. So it's kind of has this creamy, powdery feel to it it's so it's a different consistency that i noticed with her other um highlighting palettes so i do see the difference in them and it it is very pigmented you guys it's very pigmented so go in with a slight hand or if you like your highlighters to be wham bam go ahead and pack it on <laughs> so let's go ahead and jump into the swatches cat is this shade right here it has a peachy vibe to it, a pinky, a light pinky peachy vibe to it. <laughs> so Forever Young has a light champagne vibe going on here. It has a very orangey shade to it, so it would be nice to put on your face if you're doing like a bronze summer lit look. But this is Daydream. This on my face, I don't know about that. <laughs> um, but. It is very creamy, has the same consistency as the other shadows. It seems the most pigmented. Do you see that? Oh gosh. But that is Forever Lit. Glow Getter has this gold warm look. So it's starting to get a little warmer, but it's very golden. And this is 143, so this one has a more warm, this is the warmest gold look in her palette. Alright you guys, so those are the shades right here. I did go ahead and swatch each and every one of them for you. I love these shades so much. As a matter of fact, one thing that I love about this palette is that you can mix and make your own highlighter shades in here. So I'm just going to go ahead, right now I have Glow Getter on my cheeks, but I'm just going to go over with 143. The only thing I don't like about the palette is that it kicks up a lot of product. That's it. So the highlighter right here this is 143 and I'm just darkening up you know brightening and bronzing up the area why not can never have too much highlighter <laughs> oh gosh <laughs> um and let me go in with daydream over here just to see how it mixes with glow getter so right now this is glow getter and I'm turning over the brush you know the clean side of the brush so I'm not mixing the shades too much Wow, you know, Daydream is very wearable. Oh my gosh, Daydream is so wearable. I thought that Daydream was going to have too much of a orange look to it, but it just warms up Glow Getter. Eee. I really like the orange look to it, you guys. I think I might be mixing these two a lot more. So this is Daydream and Glow Getter. 
and this is they this is glow getter at 143 you guys these highlighters are nothing to be played with like they're pigmented they're gonna knock you out the park take your time when using it take your time take your time <laughs> thank you so much for watching you guys i hope you enjoyed i hope this video helped you out to see if you want the palette or not or if you already have the palette let me know all your thoughts and comments down below bye guys